Hi guys, today I'll be showing you a really cool trick for Touch ID iOS device users. This trick is for you to use multiple fingers to scan your Touch ID enabled devices. In fact, you can use more than five fingers. As you have known that, Apple only allows you to add five fingers to scan on your Touch ID enabled devices. So have you wished that you would be able to add more fingers? Well, technically, this bug has been discovered a long time ago, since iOS 9, I think. But Apple doesn't care to fix it yet. What's even crazier is that you can use two different people's fingerprints on a finger scan when you add. Okay, let me show you this trick. Again, it's a bug, I think, because Apple should not let this happen. So you go to settings, and then touch ID and password. So as you can see here, I have five fingerprints. Now I want to remove all of them and show you. Okay, let's keep this one. I think this is my thumb fingerprint. Yes. If I try the other finger, it doesn't work. This side also doesn't work. So this one, my left thumb. So again, we go back. I want to add a new finger. So the trick here is very simple. What you do is you keep scanning all your fingers. The trick is when it vibrates, you just chain the finger. So first finger, second finger, third, and the last one. Again, you keep doing it until this red thing complete. Because I already have one finger for my thumb, so I only use four. But you can use all of them as well. So keep scanning your fingers until it says complete. Okay, click continue. You're doing the same. Done. Now, you see I only have two fingers here. One is my thumb, and the other one, all of these. I mean, if Apple fix this back, only one finger will work. But let's see if all my four fingers here will work or not. Let's lock the device. Again, we start with this one. You know it will work because the first finger that I add. Now let's try the second one. See, it worked as well. Try this one. Again, it worked. This one. And the last one. See? It's really cool. So right now I only have two fingers added, but I can scan all my five fingers. It's really awesome. You can just use five fingers for one finger print added. Let's try the other side. So this side I will use all my five fingers. Okay, continue. Start from thumb. Done. Okay, again, you only see three fingers added, but I can use all of my fingers. Again, start with this one. Scan. This one. Also work. Okay. Last one. See? I'm not sure if it is a trick or Apple leave it like that, but didn't tell anyone. But again, this is a very cool trick. And what is even cooler, as like I said earlier, you can use it with two different people fingerprints. It just work. I already tried it. Again, this is a very cool trick. If you're using Touch ID devices, this is how you can add as many fingers as you want to. I have never tried 10 of them, but let's find out together, I think. It's better if you can just do it in one blow. Let's remove all of this. Even the first one here. Okay, let's try all fingers, see what happened. One, two, 
three, four, five. The other side. One, two, three, four. Okay. It looks like you can't. He said unable to read this finger. So it's too many. Let's try seven. I think it works. Seven, maybe. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Seven. One. Two, three, four, five, six. Okay, now we're done. One fingerprint, seven fingers. Let's test it. Okay, it work. Okay, that's this one doesn't work. This one work. This one also work. This one. This one also work. Let's try the other side. This one work. Okay. So based on this testing, it works only six fingers, up to six fingers for one fingerprint. But still, if you think about this, it's a lot because in total you can add five fingerprints, and each fingerprint you can add six additional fingers. So that's a lot. Okay, that's it, guys. This is a cool trick for how to add more than five fingers on your Touch ID devices. Thank you so much for watching. If you like the video, please give us a thumbs up, comment down below, and subscribe for more useful videos in the future. Have a great day, guys. See you in the next video.